Okay, in this video, I'm just going to really quickly show you kind of, it's a little trick. Um, it's a way that you can um, convert from radians to decimal degrees um, or just degrees. So I'm in radian mode, and this I think is only going to work on the cast because I'm going to put pi. But what I want to do is I want to put 2, so I'm going to do 2 pi divided by 3, and then I'm going to press the catalog key. And um, so the easiest thing to probably do at this point is press 2 to jump over to this menu. And when you do that, you'll see there's a lot of things. We want angle, so I'm going to press to the right. And then I'm going to scroll down until it says uh, convert to decimal degrees. So what I want to do is convert to decimal degrees, and I'm going to press enter, and it converts it. So uh, now you can do all kinds of weird things. And this is obviously something that you need to know how to do without uh, this kind of trick. You just multiply by 180 over pi and then simplify. Um, but it's good to know that you can do it. So maybe this, and I'm going to press the catalog key again. It defaults to the last thing you did, so it's still on that. And press enter, and it converts it for you. So you can see we get that. Um, I think we can probably do it the other way. So let me change my mode here, doc72. I'm going to change to degree mode. And so you can see up here, I'm in degrees. Uh, let's convert 118 degrees. So I'm, gonna, so I'm in degree mode. So right now it thinks that's 118 degrees. I'm going to pick convert to radians and press enter. And if I instead do it by hand, it would be 118, um, 118 times pi over 180. And you can see we get the same value. Um, so this is a, a really quick way that you can do it. And uh, you don't have to remember the pi over 180, the 180 over pi. So if you're allowed to use a calculator and you suddenly are drawing a blank, this is uh, how you can do it. So I hope you found this helpful and good luck.